Number five item may very well be video of that elusive internet creature known as the walrus. Hmm. Or, more accurately, it's a video of an elephant seal minding its own business on the beach when suddenly some woman runs up to it and pokes it. Yeah, but, but does he like it? You're going to have to be the judge of that. Uh, I bet he does. Seal lunch. Yeah. And a hilarious macro. Totally. Yeah. I love that. Is that, that what video. you look like when you're disturbed in the middle of the night? Yes. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why are you poking my bum? <laughs> That's what he did. Poked some, his bum. Okay, you know what? Moving on. Animals! Actually, no, let's hang out on this topic for a minute. Let's talk no, about this. I'm ignoring you, Mr. Okay. Pereira. You're getting the why, was, why were they poking your bum, Allison? No, they poked the seal's bum. Right. In a role play scenario, you were the one that was getting a vote. Like I poked my bum. All right, we're good. Five. Can we go back to more animals? Okay, the animals aren't all about trying to scare away humans, though, like the seal. Today's number four shows us that they want to love us a lot, too. Mm. Yes, this is from a remake of the groundbreaking British nature documentary, Last Chance to See, starring the most British comedian on Twitter, Stephen Fraud. A typical male, Sirocco is clearly only interested in one thing. <laughs> oh, look at that. <laughs> Ow. God, he's got sharp tools. <laughs> he's getting a bit frisky. Ow. <laughs> oh, <he's lost. laughs> you are being shagged by a rare parrot. Thinks you are. Oh, he's really going for it. Wow, you've chosen him. Is it actually you were in pain, aren't you? That's right. Always neck is covered. Am I? I I didn't think animals with beaks could smile, but that thing had the happiest little face. It was having a good time. And now we know where bird flu came from. Oh. Sure. Do you remember that innocent, incoherently panicky days of bird flu? Oh, yes. Yeah, times were simpler then. Not at all like this panic we have with swine flu. Oh, yeah. Swine flu! <laughs> Do you cry flu. out at night into, into it's, the window? It's just flu! <laughs> Damn you, swine flu! I do. I do. Do you get the shot? No! no? You get those shots, you get sicker. What? No. You get more sick if you get flu shots. My friend got a flu shot and ended up in the hospital. Is your for friend four Glenn days. Beck? Do you think your friends because you watch his show? Yes. Okay. Uh, now that we've shocked you with interspecies sex, I agree on the shot. Uh, we're gonna make you. Uh, well, we're actually gonna make it a little bit more wholesome for today's Thank number goodness. three, which features natural, wholesome, God-approved turtle on turtle action. Yeah. Now, now we know what you're all thinking. I wonder what turtle sex looks and or sounds like. Well, calm down, because you're about to see it for yourself. Uh, and you will never forget it. <laughs> we just witnessed turtle climax, and that was hysterical. Yeah, that was it. But the, the lady turtle looked way bored. Do you think the, the, the man turtle didn't seem to care, though? That's like no. Parallels, parallels the humans Weird. as well. Uh, turtle sex sounds a lot like Pereira sex, by the way. Um, I just wanted to give you another and image that you can't erase from your brain. And yeah. and yeah. All right, and at number two today, yeah. it stains the cupcake dog. What? And th yeah, this is, <laughs> yay stains. This is a mashup of Animal Planet's It's Me or the Dog. Yeah, and, and with a little Luxie Turna by Clint Mansell fans, Clint fans, oh yeah. yeah. The result is pure science. Away. Away. That is animal cruelty. 
team. Poor Stain. Poor thing. Would you have a dog named Stains in your house? No, I would no. never have a dog named Stains in my house, but I would take them places. That'd be really? fun. I'd, I'd bring some Stains to your place. No. You, know, like... you have already brought enough Stains to my place. Whoa. I just had to say that. It was so obvious. I had to say it. <laughs> oh, thank you. It's one of these shows. Still ahead, <laughs> animals will talk in our number one around the net. <laughs> I told you to give me the dry cleaning bill. I told you I'd be a gentleman. I'd take care of you. I don't know why I said that. But you went to Steven. I don't know why. You know why. You know exactly why you said that. Oh, boy. It is, in fact, time. And animal videos. Yeah. It was a big, big year for animals on the internet. And, it and it's, it's tough to pick a favorite, but we have. And our favorite animal video of the year comes to us from the BBC program, Walk on the Wild Side. Yeah! Now, what they do is fairly simple. They, they shot video of cute but disease-laden creatures and then let us listen to what they're saying and thinking with the power of voiceover. Alan! 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 Al! Alan! John, I don't think we're allowed to wear. It's fine. Just keep a lookout. <laughs> what was that? That was me zip. Whoa! What? Where did all these come from? You know me, lads. I can't weave with an audience. Alan! 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 Hey, are you filming me in the bath? Get out! How am I? I'm naked. You better not put it on YouTube. Oh, so that's not Alan. Steve, that Steve. Steve! 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 And they're just so much funnier with British accents. Absolutely. <laughs> Chimps and elephants are thought to have complex, complex languages between yes, them, actually. but not so complex that they can ask me to stop eating them. Because I'm telling you, dolphin is delicious. <laughs> really, it's like, it's like the cake of the sea. Just, just eat tuna fish. Little red velvet dolphin, gonna cut you up and eat you. <laughs> Get your daily viral fix and to check out all the viral videos we have to offer, go to the allnewg4tv.com slash around the net.